Hi, this is Anke Chuhi. I'm over here at uh, Lowe's with Macester. He's the guy who is going to help us today to pick out the supplies you need to create your own raised bed. And like I've been saying, this is the time to actually grow your food. So this is the lumber yard. I'm just going to show you. But what we're going to do today is actually select all the supplies you need for your raised bed. So I'm going to get Macester here to explain to us what we are actually getting. Go ahead. So okay. It's very dusty here. Okay. We're gonna use this lumber. These are two by sixes. Okay. We're gonna look one, two, three high. So we okay. have fifteen, or actually we get sixteen and a half inches yes. tall. So we yes. have a deep bed. Yes. And then we're gonna use each one, and we're gonna cut it in half. Okay. They're gonna be four feet wide. Okay. And eight feet long. All right. Then we're gonna. The easiest thing to do is come over here okay. and pick out a lag bolt. Okay. And the lag bolts can connect the corners. Okay. And these ones can go through All right. each corner and, and connect them without any other fasteners. I see. So that's and what size is this? This is a kind of a long size, so okay. let's see which one are we gonna choose? We're gonna choose I think the three this is a four inch. I see. I think the three inch. Okay. Good. Open up, okay. Um, let's see. Yeah, I think the three inch will do it. Wonderful. All right. So what else do we need? We also need a weed mat. Okay. And uh, some kind of aggregate like uh, gravel okay. or cinder. All right. For the bottom. The weed mat is to make sure we don't get the weeds coming through. We don't need that regrowth. Absolutely. Yeah, we need a head start and I exclude. See. It's an exclusion method. In I see. Farming. Wonderful. And what we are doing is that we are having an, a raised bed of eight feet long by four, four feet four wide. wide. So, so for each bed we need nine pieces. For each bed we need nine, nine pieces, pieces of this timber. Because on each level we're going to cut one eight foot board in half yes. to be the two ends. Okay. So that's one level. Okay. Three. Yes. And then we're going to do three levels. So that's nine. Nine. Okay. And the bed we are creating is going to be 18 inches high. Okay. Well it's going to be because this this uh, lumber is actually five and a half inches. Okay. Then we're going to three of them is actually six. It's, oh, it's like seventeen inches. Okay. Sixteen and a half. Okay, sixteen and a half okay. inches Just high, under. and that's why that's deep enough to grow your root crops. Yes, you can grow yes. root crops. Quite yes. Easily. Yes. So. That's what you're picking out. So we are gonna make, how many of these are we getting today? We're gonna get 36. 36 of these yeah, for four, four beds. beds. Yeah. Wonderful, so you see now, so if you need to have a raised bed, so don't get worried, it's easy to create. If you're here in Hawaii, of course, we are gonna get Marquesa to come over and do your raised bed. But we are right here at Lowe's and we are gonna be picking out all the supplies we need. And we'll show you the steps by step in the bed creation, the raised bed creation. So I'm so excited because one of my home gardeners is going to be growing her vegetables and especially at this time when we need to grow our own food and um, just take things in your hands, get control of your food supply and that's what we are doing today. So thank you so much. This is Anne Gachuhi. Click on the link below because we are give, going to give you all these supplies in a PDF so that you can get them for yourself and be able to start growing your own food. Thank you. Bye.